Hello everyone, this is Lillian and it's time for our 3 minutes with the word audio devotional. Today's topic is, are you still salty? And our anchor scripture is taken from the book of Matthew chapter 5 and verse 13. You are the salt of the earth, but if the salt loses its flavor, how shall it be seasoned? It is then good for nothing but to be thrown out and trampled under fruit by men. Today, please, if you are a believer listening in, the Lord is saying to you, do not lose your flavor. The scripture says that we are the salt of the earth. We are the salt of the earth, not the salt of the church only. We can behave a certain way in church and return to a different way afterwards. We are to be flavor to the world we live in. Please, we must judge ourselves. How do we speak? How do we dress? What is our attitude to people? These days, I look on social media and I think maybe believers feel that God is blind to that aspect of their lives. I see comments written by believers on social media posts and I am shocked at the rudeness, the abusive and hateful comments being thrown about even on Christian posts. This has become the norm for some Christians. I see Christians hide behind grace to dress in the most indecent and reckless of manners. Christians now use swear words and want to do everything the world does. Please, today's scripture was not said by me. It was said by Jesus, the one who we claim is the Lord of our life. He said, you are the salt of the earth. You cannot be like the rest of the world. When you cook rice, for instance, do you put as much salt as rice? No, salt serves a different function and cannot want to be like the rice. Salt has a different character. My dear listeners, if you are too blended into the world, there is a problem. As a Christian wife, the Bible says you submit to your husband. The world says don't be a fool, you are equal. Do you in a bid to move with the times act like the world? The Bible says do not worry. The world says be realistic. How do you act? The Bible says in Ephesians, let no unwholesome word come out of your mouth. The world says it is walk to swear and say anything we like. How do we act? These are only examples, my dear listeners, but the principle is the same. We are called out to be salt. Listen to what Jesus said in that same scripture. It says, he says, if the salt loses its flavor, how shall it be seasoned? It is then good for nothing but to be thrown out. And trampled underfoot by men. My dear listeners, if this does not scare you, I don't know what else will. Jesus, the one who is our savior, says that once we lose our flavor, we become good for nothing. Understand that the loss of flavor happens gradually. We must check ourselves. We must constantly examine ourselves. We should stop trying to fit in. We should rather seek to live according to God's principles. We are the salt and we should do what salt does. Let us pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, thank you so much for today. We receive grace to live our lives by your dictates and to be the salt to the earth. Continue to take all the glory, almighty God. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Speak to you again soon. If you are blessed, please drop me a line on audio devotional at yahoo.com or on our website at www.3minutesaudiodevotional.com. You could also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter at 3 Minutes Audio Devotional. Remember, wrapped up in God's word is all you need for your change to come. Love you and bye.